As we get close to the end of the semester, it's easy to lose focus and harder to stay motivated. Here are some quick tips to help you finish strong and ace your finals. Tip number one, get off your phone. When trying to study, throw your phone across the room and pray it doesn't break so you can have your full attention on studying. You can always get on your phone after studying, unless it's broken. You'll probably have better grades without your phone distracting you anyways. So sit down, buckle up, and have a wonderful time studying. Do you have a problem with procrastinating? Are your time management skills so poor your mother texts you the night before to remind you of your upcoming test? Well, you're in luck. Here are some fun tips and tricks to planning ahead and staying on time so we can get good grades on these upcoming papers and upcoming finals. Have a look. Here's a fun little planner that I like to use for my weekly um, schedule, as well as how I like to plan ahead for taking tests or writing papers. I have it all planned out within five days, just giving myself time limits and putting in breaks, I think is really important, as well as reminding myself that I don't have to do it all in one night, but I can do it over a course of five days. Another great thing about this is once it's done, I can just pull it off and get ready for the new week. While studying, make sure you rewrite your notes and color code them in the process. This way you can make sure you remember the material and stay organized in the process. I like to take notes on my computer during class, but then when it comes to studying, I transfer them down to a piece of paper, use words and images that will remind me of the topic, highlight definitions in yellow and examples in orange, and then decorate with anything that will help me remember key subjects. Are you tired of just staring at your review sheets, not knowing how you're gonna retain all the information? Well, then I have the solution for you. Quizlet has awesome features like flashcards, learn, write, spell, and even makes tests for you. My favorite feature in Quizlet is Quizlet Learn. After I create a Quizlet with all the exams, definitions, terms, questions, etc., I put it into learn mode. Learn mode creates a personalized study plan based on your familiarity with a set's content. As you answer more questions correctly, you're advanced from easier multiple choice questions to harder written ones. To finish your round, all you have to do is answer each question right twice. After each round, you'll see them grouped together by level of mastery. Familiar means you answered correctly once and master means you answered correctly both times. This studying method really lets you lock those answers into your brain and not only memorize them, but learn them. All right, so that brings us to our last study tip for you guys, which is to work someplace other than your bed. Although it's really easy to just wake up in the morning and log into your early morning class right away, it's a lot better if you're able to actually make the effort to get out of bed and go work somewhere else in your house. That can be on your couch, at your desk, basically anywhere other than your bedroom. Basically, this allows you to focus better while you're working during the day, and then at night it lets you get better sleep because you can keep a separation between work and relaxing. Well, that's all the study tips we have for you guys today. Hopefully you find one or more of these tips helpful, and they help you ace your finals in the next couple weeks. Good luck!